FATAL PEDESTRIAN ACCIDENT LAST NIGHT RAISES SAFETY CONCERNS ABOUT A CROSSWALK ON NIMITZ HIGHWAY. THIS IS NEAR THE SALVATION ARMY AND ROSS STORE. POLICE SAY A MOTORCYCLIST WAS SPEEDING WHEN HE HIT A WOMAN. SHE DIED AND HE'S LISTED IN CRITICAL CONDITION. JED BONIZA HAS MORE. POLICE SAID THE MOTORCYCLIST CHANGED LANES TO PASS SEVERAL CARS THAT WERE STOPPED IN FRONT OF THE CROSSWALK WAITING FOR PEDESTRIANS. They said the motorcyclist then hit the 50 year old woman who was crossing the street inside the marked crosswalk. See, look how fast this car's going. That's way over the speed limit, probably. I met with Stephen Wong, the owner of Wong Wei Driving Academy, at the crosswalk on the corner of Sumner Street in Nimitz Highway, the location of Monday night's fatal pedestrian accident. The speed limit is 35 miles per hour, yet we stood there watching cars whiz by. Would I feel comfortable crossing here? Not at all, not here. Wong says it's a dangerous location for a crosswalk to be located right after a turn. We see it coming around this corner. If you're coming fast, you might not, you might not see a pedestrian getting ready to cross here. I sat down with Senator Lorraine Inouye, chair of the Transportation Committee. She says there are a number of ways the issue can be addressed. Either a flashing um, light or those lights that are, uh, are created on the roads. She says she's also drafting a resolution to review crosswalk locations to see if they should be removed or added for safety reasons. I also reached out to the Department of Transportation. In a statement, they say there are no plans at this time to remove the crosswalk at North Nimitz Highway and Sumner Street, but we will consider additional methods to improve unsignalized crosswalks in the area when we begin the North Nimitz Alamoana Boulevard resurfacing later this year. Inouye also urges drivers to remember to stay focused on the road when they're behind the wheel. Wong says that even if pedestrians are supposed to have the right of way when crossing inside a crosswalk, they still need to make sure that the driver of the car sees them before crossing because ultimately the pedestrian will be the loser if anything goes wrong. From Nimitz Highway, Jen Boniza, K2 News, working for Hawaii.